Hello everyone, Cat here. Welcome back to GeoGuess for Lucky Number 13. Now I'm not doing this in the middle of the night like I did last episode, so this should be better, at least commentary-wise, and I can talk a bit louder. Um, so let's see where this goes. So we're on a fairly large road, and it's not. Uh, this looks more South America. What is that road name? Tell. Why is it blurred out? Why? What do you get out of that? What? There's no reason for that to be blurred out. Okay, it's a BR-153. Brazil-153? Truck, tell me something. Tell me anything. You tell me nothing. F has a few signs that were in like Spanish, Portuguese, one of those, so... At least know I'm in that sort of... Um, South America, at least. For certain. But I'm guessing it has to be Brazil. The only problem is I need to find a 153. Up oh, there it is, 153. Found it. Um, I don't know if it is a 153, but I'd have to take the guess. I'm just gonna leave it there because I doubt I'm gonna find out where on the 153. Does it end up here? 155. I guess it ends right here. Okay, that's that's a good sign. Um, I need to see where it ends on the other side though. If it goes down a long ways, then... Okay, I think it could... Nope, keeps going. That's not a good thing. Because that means it could be anywhere on the 153. So I may have to do a more central placement, like right down here. Because it could be anywhere on top of the 153. Actually, I need to think about this, because when I first saw that sign, it said that I was 150-something miles into the 153, and... So that means I gotta be like, and I'm going south, so I have to be like 100 miles into it. Okay, so as it starts here, I gotta be like around here. Maybe? I might be right on that. We're gonna have to find out. I don't think the sign up here tells me anything, and I don't think I have enough time for it. Yep, big guess. I was, nope, it was the other side. Uh, of course it was. Of course, it's that end of the 153. Of course, it is. Oh uh, my gosh. Just, just of course, it is. I got the road correct. I think. Yes, I did. But really, the opposite end. Oh, I had a feeling that would happen. Next round. Um. Okay. This. Looks a lot cooler than Brazil, because Brazil's not nice in any single way. Okay, 145. Does that mean we're on Route 45, or is that the mile marker? So I did use a mile marker before. Uh, this, I want to say it's... I was originally thinking Norway, but this doesn't look like Norway. The street view is actually... It's just like some high-quality street view. I don't know why this just... I don't know why this street view looks like... 10 times better than most street view. Must have been like taking this year or something. Signs that will help me. Tell me something. Uh, that's no. Oh gosh, that's not good. Okay. Um. Hmm. That's not what I want to see. Okay. Those towns are that way. 94. What does that other sign say? I can't read any of that. So. I'm gonna say it's Russia. It could be Mongolia too. I do know for a fact it can be Mongolia. It's pretty much one thing is that you gotta look for that. The farthest sign away is probably gonna be the biggest town. So if you're able to find that town, it'll be good. Oh, and ah, there it is. Okay, so I need to find the um, what is it? Let me find up oh, there's that town and that town. Oh my gosh. That is that is phenomenal. Okay, so I'm right there. Wait, not right. And eh, maybe right there. Okay, let's see, because that's 40 miles away. And I'm 16. That, I think that is around where I am. If I'm able to zoom in a bit closer. Am I able to find anything that would hint to where exactly I am? 
There's like nothing here though. Go in the opposite direction just to see. There's rivers around here. But I don't know where those rivers are. I also need to take a look at how the road turns. Because I mentioned I was going 14 away, so I'm around here. I'm in this area and I kinda wanna think it's like around here. Because this is a long road. And then Yeah, I wanna say I'm like right around here. Okay, so that's the way the road's turning. And then it turns the other way. Yeah, okay. So I think I'd be around here. Okay, yeah, I'm a bit of a ways down. And then right over here is probably where that sign was. I don't think I'll have enough time to get to this place, but oh well. At least I know I'm close. Uh, yeah, there's not really any roads around here until I get to like in town, so I guess I was only two miles away. Okay, so I was over here. Let's see if it's that way, if I was going in that direction. I don't think I moved that much. That move, that part of the road does make sense though. Oh, because I was looking at it from the opposite way. Okay, that, that, okay, I should have uh, thought of that, but I didn't. Oh well, next round, I'm very much happy with getting that many points on it. And this one, for some reason, okay, now it is. Um, windmills, and okay, I was about to say America, but that is not American at all. Uh, other country uses wind power. Probably a lot. Signs. Uh, I don't know what any of those are. It looks Scandinavian. So I need to look for an E45. This could be, uh, what is it, um, like, Stony or Latvia as well. So I can look in there as well. Okay, the E45 is in Denmark. It took me way too long to figure out, and it's gonna cost me a lot of time, actually. Because I've only got less than a minute left. So I have to find that a, Cere a Cerebro somewhere. I'm not able to find it. So I can find it in like the next couple seconds. I don't think I'm gonna be able to find it. Nope, it was Sweden? What? B45's not even in Sweden. What? It shows nothing of the E45 anywhere in here. I'm confused. Cerebro doesn't show up anywhere. And E45 is not, whoops, not even close. What? I'm confused. Next round. Okay. Um, oh. Okay, that's a very, very small road. A little of rocky hills and stuff. So if I had to guess, this is Scotland. The Turkey, yeah, this is definitely Scotland. <laughs> Hooray, road ends, and I am... I have absolutely no clue. Nothing tells me where in Scotland I am. I'm gonna say I'm like farther north but I don't know where that I don't know where any of this is gonna be I'm just gonna throw myself over there so yeah I really found absolutely nothing as far as this guess so so much for that I'm probably gonna put myself lower just in case I don't want it to be too terrible and make guess was I close oh my 30 miles, 31 miles away. I was on a, yeah, I would not have found anything there. Actually, I should have tried going on that road. That would have actually led me somewhere. But, yep, it was a good, it was an, I, I could not, I am so happy I moved myself there, but 
Gosh, I would not have found that out at all if I tried. So, I'm very happy with that. Uh, random luck. As I said, lucky number 13. So this next place looks fairly North American. I don't know where in North America it would be. This could be US or Canada. Okay, something's now telling me that this probably is Canada. Signs... Um, those... It doesn't tell me much further than it's like golf course. What does this say? Is that kilometers? Kilometers! We're in Canada! I don't know where in Canada. Probably somewhere in this green area. But, yay, I found... I found out that we're at least in something. Yep, maximum 100. That that tells you it. Okay. Uh, what does he sign say? Settler in Rosaland. Rosaland. Uh, I feel like Settler I've heard of before somewhere in Canada. I'm not going to be able to find it, fortunately, but just hope that my current guess of right over here in southern Saskatchewan is correct. And no, it was in, uh, what was it? Alberta. Okay, so it's down here, there's... Yeah, I wasn't going to be able to find that um, on myself. Actually, the settler's right there. I'm not really that big. Okay. But anyway, I'm okay with that, even though it's 400 miles away. For Canada, that's not extremely terrible. View summary, 18,000 points. I'll take it. I'll, I'll upload it. And yeah, so that's going to do it. As always, the link will be in the description so you can play it yourself. And yeah, thanks everybody for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and goodbye.